hey everybody, this is Ernie Hatmaker. It is barely 5.30 outside, and I just wanted to get out of here before the sun came up, because it's hot already. Coming out here just before it's really light outside also gives me time to illuminate any pest problems I might be having on my tomatoes with all those butterflies coming through. I pulled off a couple of um, black caterpillars. Well, you know, we call them caterpillars, but we know they're larvae. And there were a few in the dirt um, the other day that I also was able to, to grab. I think that, that snails over there messing with those. No, I have something different for them. Some little uh, purple tomatoes that are coming out that I'm going to be planting in the, the garden. Look at these. My little bug, get out of the way. The horse flies are out. Did you hear that? They are out. It's a moth going away. It's like, oops, that's the wrong flame for me. Now I'm going to have to turn this flash off soon or I'm going to be mobbed. That leaf right there has actually stopped deteriorating, if you can believe that. That was the orange oil. Hey, look at that. That's an Arkansas Traveler tomato. It's actually got roots coming out. Not just those little nodes that come out. But yeah, it's got roots coming out. Pretty interesting. This is a Sugar Rush peach pepper. There's one, two down there. I've harvested most of the ones from this. And here I'm starting a, a yellow, to, uh, not tomato, um, what do you call that thing? Dang it, um, watermelon. There's a spider in that. Hope you're getting some bugs. I'm going to have to cut back these morning glories. Believe it or not, they're taking over. And this will become a morning glory basket. There's a couple of baby squash in there. I'll show them to you when they get a little bigger. That yellow lemon starburst was not yellow yesterday. It looked more like that one with just a little hint of yellow. It pretty much turned yellow overnight. And then the rest of these are yellow pear tomatoes. You guessed it. It's a yellow bucket. This is a Batik Samara melon, which I showed the other day. It's kind of drawn up a little bit. When it gets hot, it spreads out. Look at that. There's a bunch of them over there. 